Blessings, chosen ones. I pray everyone is having a beautiful day. I had told you all on a previous video that I was going to put up the devotionals that I missed. I was not able to post them. I have to buy a new laptop. And it's just a whole lot of other stuff going on in the name of Jesus. So this title, this devotional is titled, Where is God? Let the hearts of those who seek the Lord rejoice. Seek the Lord and his strength. Seek his presence continually. Remember the wondrous works that he has done, his miracles and the judgments he uttered. He is the Lord our God. His judgments are in all the earth. First Chronicles 16 verses 10 through 12 and 14. ESV version. Let all those who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. Let such as your love salvation say continue it. The Lord be magnified. Psalm 40 verses 16. New King James Version. I love those who love me. And those who seek me diligently will be. I'm sorry. Those who seek me diligently will find me. Proverbs 8, verses 17, New King James Version. So if we continue to seek God diligently, we diligently we are going to find God every time. In the name of Jesus, it is when we don't give God our time, when we pay God no mind. And I don't know no one that wants to do that because me, I know I need God every day. Every single day I need God, morning, noon, and night every minute on the hour and i hope you all feel the same way every second every day okay i'm going to read the devotional and then i am going to read a couple more scriptures to you all where is god in a world with christian radio stations tv programs movies books churches and dis dis disciples the question remains where is god Sometimes you will find him in the noise of spectacular thunderstorm, but sometimes he is in the soft whisper of the wind. The fact is he is here. He was here yesterday and will be here tomorrow in the name of Jesus. No one can get rid of God. God is going to always be with his children. He is going to always be with us. And in Proverbs 8 verses 17, what does it say? I love those who love me. And those who seek me diligently will find me. I love those who love me. God love those who love him. Psalm 9 verses 10, New King James Version. Those who know your name will put their trust in you. For you, Lord, have not forsaken those who seek you. Seek the Lord your God and you will find him. If you seek him with all your heart and with all your soul. Deuteronomy 4 verses 29, New King James Version. The lions may grow weak and hungry, but those who seek the Lord lack no good things. Psalm 34 verses 10. You seek God, you are not going to lack no good thing. The Lord is with you while you are with him. If you seek him, he will be found by you. But if you forsake him, he will forsake you. 2 Chronicles 15 verses 2. ESV version. That is why it is so important to have a relationship with God and not just run to God when you think you need him or you're in some type of trouble. It is best that we keep a relationship with God every day, that we continue our relationship with God every day and we do not stop it under no, no, no shape or form. In the name of Jesus, we must continue our relationship with God because God is letting us know we will find him if we have a relationship with him. We're going to find him. If you want a relationship with him, you're going to find him. But we got to seek him in the name of Jesus. So I pray this devotional has blessed you all. And I will talk to you all in the next video. Blessings.